In this video, I'll be showing you how to use Shape Software's point of sale portal. The first thing you'll need to do is make sure your lead is added to the system. And then you'll go to this portal tab. From there, you'll choose your document set. So these document sets can be tailored to the loan type. And once you select the document set, it will choose all of those documents that you need for that loan type. Next, you'll come up here to this top right hand corner where it says send to portal invite. And you can either send this via email, SMS, or you can copy the portal link and share that with your client. You'll notice that this will reload and the status will change to application sent and the document count will also change right here. Now, when your client clicks on that link that you just sent them, it's going to take them here. It'll fill out the information that you already have for them and it'll also show your information on this right-hand side. So you'll wanna make sure this information is up to date in your profile settings. Next, all they will need to do is choose a password and click get started. On the left hand side, when they're logged in, it's going to show them their milestones and these will be checked off automatically as they move along in the process. Over here, they can input their application information. And as they move along, this percentage will change to show them how far along they are in the application. So they will just choose their information, fill this out. And if they don't fill out certain information, the system won't let them move along. Now, if they wanted to up, upload their documents, they'll just come up here to where it says document uploads. They'll click this upload button. Choose what they need. And it will change their document count here. And then for you, from within your CRM, those documents are going to show up here in the list. So if you wanted to preview that document, you'll just click on this arrow here. To decline it, you'll click on the X to approve it, the check mark, and the downward facing arrow if you wanted to download it. Now, when you decline it, you do have to put a reason for declining. Changes the document count here. And then for your client inside of their portal, it will show them that it was declined. And down at the bottom of their list here, it'll highlight it in red. And if they hover over the comment, it will show them why you declined it. They can then upload the documents that they need once again. Now back over here in your CRM, if for any reason you need additional documents from them, all that you need to do is come here, check those documents that you need, scroll to the bottom of the list here, and where it says update needs list, you can either send via email, SMS, or you can update this without a notification to the client. You can also add a custom document. Now this add custom doc button will only add this custom document to this person's record. So it will not add to any of your other clients. You can download all of these 
files into a zip folder, you can email the documents, and you can convert them to a PDF. Right over here on the right-hand side, you can send that pre-approval letter. You'll just need to fill out the information. Choose the template and submit. It'll give you a preview of what you're sending to your client. And you can then edit it or choose to send it. If at any point your client forgets their password or needs help logging in, you can scroll down to the bottom here and you can input a new password for them and reset that. Then you can share that password and they can get logged in. If you have any questions regarding your Shape Software point of sale portal, feel free to reach out to support at setshape.com.